Um, I remember the first time we met at Camp Sunshine, sitting on the rocking chairs in the tot lot back in 2012 with the babies. That was the one time you were in there. I know you're a teen girl for life. Um, and I truly believe it was for us to meet in that moment. Who knew the diaper changing, kid corralling days, and bright yellow shirts in the middle of Maine volunteering would bring us to this moment. We've been through so, so much together the last eight years. So many laughs, so many tears, and more laughs after that, of course. From late nights at Toby's, those days are long gone because they are closed and we are getting old. Um, to cod weekends, I'll never live down the cod, ever. Um, making our boys stop at the cranberry bog for our photo shoot last October. I can see their eye, eyes roll from here. <laughs> um, too many throwback sleepovers at your house, making sure we signed in on the sheet of paper on the kitchen table so that Car Carla and Joe would know that we were home safely. Um, a funny example of this is the time that we both hurt ourselves. Shocking. Um, <laughs> we went to Country Fest anyways, and this is when I first met Andrew. Little did he know what he was getting into when he met me. Your parents were shocked because we were up long way, we were home way before they went to bed um, because we were both hurting and with my sprained ankle and your knee. So we hobbled back to the car. Um, Andrew was a trooper, although he walked a million miles ahead of us, probably embarrassed of us, um, because we were slow and struggling as we heckled him from behind. But he was in front of, he was actually in front of us to pull up the car like the gentleman that he is. <laughs> of course, because apparently we both need bubble wrap. I need it more than you do, thank goodness. You've been the greatest friend to me all these years, through it all, and I'm humbled you asked me to be your maid of honor. A gift I will cherish no matter what it took to get here. I love you so much and I'm so happy you get to marry your best friend. Aww. Andrew. <laughs> from quotes like, I'm all about that caramel swirl. <laughs> and, and yay, yay, we always speak to each other in our own language. Remember that time in February when we were at Camp Sunshine and I was referring to the pretty lights on the volleyball Newcomb court, very much like this, actually. <laughs> um, and I looked at you, but I didn't actually realize I was looking directly at you and I said out loud, we should get married here, <laughs> as a general statement. <laughs> Well, that was awkward given this moment, but it's hilarious. <laughs> you are the best thing to happen to my friend. It wasn't easy the road she traveled to get to you, but man, was it worth it. It makes me so happy to see her so happy. It was really special to be right there to witness your proposal at our favorite place, Camp Sunshine at Sebago Lake. Thank you for making that a session to remember for all of us. Thank you for giving your time to something that we love so much and where Jess and I met many years ago. Thank you for all you do for her and us. Like preparing my bed when I sleep over the house these days with a camo sheet, of course. You spend so many nights from the very beginning as our designated driver, or just just our driver just because we told you to. And we usually didn't, we surely didn't tip you enough for that. Or the countless times you became our professional photographer at every single event. Another shocker for those who know me slash us not. <laughs> I can't promise you I won't ask you to take a picture of Jess and I at your wedding day, but you'll just have to do your usual duty in that moment. Thanks in advance. It's truly been awesome to get to know you the past five years and to recently introduce you to the one that I love. It's crazy how similar you two are with your trucks and guns and camo. You treat Jess so well and I'm so excited to see how your life unfolds together. Jess and Andrew, it's truly by sunshine and grace that we made it to this day and I couldn't be happier to stand by beside you both. Hands up, baby. Cheers to Mr. and Mrs. Biba. Ladies and gentlemen, the staff here at Wrights Mill Farm have put together what I'm sure will be an amazing buffet for each and every one of us here tonight. We do ask